how you guys doing? I'm just cleaning my space because today I cleaned and recharged the um, Himalaya crystals. So they're all outside with the beautiful sun. And wow, you know, for me is I learned in Japan about keeping your dojo or your sanctuary clean because this is a place where you just be one and we when we learn about things of certain stuff in life we go through so much diversity as we all know because look at what's going on right now it's crazy and so like i've been saying check out the red sea you know, and so there's a lot of action that happened, and this is the kind of thing I've been saying about earth shadowing things because we need to be prepared on, you know, what's going on, and you know, everybody because U.S. is being such a strong force in the world, a lot of people really look upon America, and. So these are the things that's happening right now. And so really, it's a very, like I said, a chaotic time, you know? And this is what August is all about because it's the yin and the yang energy that's just, and so, um, you know, and it just so happened, the new moon fell on, excuse me, the full moon, last month fell on the almost a time period when um, the start of the line Porter gate portal gate opens and so when that happens it happens every year but just so happened that this year on August the 8th was the new moon and so we had back to back when it just opened and on the 8th is the most strongest time when it starts to that energy, that frequency that just rises up. And so for me, I was so, so sick. I never been this sick. I thought I had diabetes. I'm going, you know, I'm going crazy. Like I can't stop spinning. It felt like I was on this ride you know you get off the ride and your head just spins and that's how i was feeling and it wouldn't stop and so i thought oh okay and then my digestive system it wasn't working good and you know there was a whole bunch of stuff that you know your monkey mind goes off to thinking oh my god i have this and that but never once did i really think i had corona because you know that's another thing is that preventive care no matter what happens whether you have taken the shot or not taken the shot preventive care is so important because we really need to boost up our powerhouse this is this our body is our our armed force you know and so it's so important that we do line that up and the best way that to do it is really working on your vagus nerve, not Las Vegas, but your vagus nerve that comes here to over here. And so I'm gonna be offering those services and really I'm just, you know, testing one, two, three, my room and how it works, how it functions, and as you can see, it's it's really clean and so um, that's how I like it that's how it should be you know very simple very clean and really just feeling that that energy that we came here for and so you know this month I'm gonna go into a lot because you know this transition of energy was really has taken me like my headaches and you know my my legs were just tingling sensation and it was just it was just something i i you know i was like on my second you know whole entire body exam check again because like i said i went in june and i honestly thought i had diabetes and you know my thing came out to be one 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 
<laughs> and when I saw that, I was like, okay, get back to that one, one, one self of yourself and start to really heal from the inside out. So we're all on this journey, you know, and we just got to keep on fighting and fighting to keep our immunity system up. And we also need to make sure we have our time to meditate, to concentrate, and breathe the breath of life. So there is a lot of chaos, like I said, like super duper chaos, because from the chaos, it's going to bring a challenge. And so, you know, I do talk a lot, and so I do need to put, and I put a whole bunch of tips into one, so I'm trying to get organized here, because once I start going on my talking spree, you know, I got so much things I love to share, you know, about how to upkeep your own private space, what kind of things, and how to clean it. You know, there's so much DIY things that I would love to share with you guys as well, too. And most of all, guess what? Our dog is stressed because we are stressed and they can feel that, break, that vibration. And so coming up is our doga class for the dogies out there, you know? So doga class has been always something I love to teach. And I was teaching it out at the, at my old build, my old orange building on Kapilani. So that's going to open, open up soon, and there's so much that I'm so excited to share, you know, not only for humans, but it's always our theme for human as well as dog experience back at the Orange Valley at Coco Jour. So the same Coco Jour is just bringing it back into the homeopathic ways and how we really need to just you know, along with this chaos, there's this challenge, and within that challenge, it's really seeking and finding ourselves so we can have the optimum health and most of all, enjoy our journey of life. So you take care and stay healthy throughout this whole entire chaos, but you know what? As they say, the fittest will survive, so Make sure you come join me and most of all, aloha.